A South Metro fire chief challenged his department's policies to help protect his fellow firefighters from getting the same cancer he got while on the job. That cancer took Chief Troy Jackson's life earlier this week, six years after his diagnosis. Today, friends, family, firefighters, even some strangers gathered to pay their respects and honor Chief Jackson's life. As I stand here on this stage today, I am certain Troy Jackson is the most courageous person I have ever known. Emergency services was Troy's calling. He had a servant's heart. I remember him being full of energy and passion for the job. And he felt he should and he could mentor other firefighters. He didn't feel sorry for himself. He never complained. He accepted his cancer and he soldiered on. Although his stubborn attitude would not show you, he was in a great deal of pain for many years, and it is with extremely happy hearts. We know he's no longer suffering and is forever home. Troy was tireless in his devotion to making sure no one else would have to go through what he'd gone through. Everyone here will never forget my dad. We will never forget his childlike giggle, his gentle hugs, and his extraordinary humor. Lastly, my dad will live on in my life with every breath I take. Every time I put on my uniform, I vow to serve the community in the same way my dad did, with love for everyone and a positive, unwavering attitude.